Hi guys, welcome to another video. By the description, you can see we're gonna discuss sharks today. Those of you who've dived a lot know how to deal with sharks. And it's one of those very common questions, especially with beginners. The first thing everybody says before they start, what about the sharks? Am I gonna be eaten? What do I do if one confronts me? How do I deal with it? It's by far the most common question for the newbies. Those of you that experienced, you don't need to watch the rest. So, I've been diving for many, many years. I started out as a fisherman. I saw my fish being eaten. I then became a commercial fisherman. Again, saw lots of my fish being eaten. I was super nervous about getting in the water, as is most people. With the advent of scuba, it tended to allow a lot more people who were nervous to get into the water when doing a scuba course with another group. And it seemed to open the avenue for spear fishermen thereafter because they were now able to get into the water together with other people and they weren't feeling as threatened. And then they realized that these sharks weren't that big man-eating meat eater that's going to just chew them up. My very first boat dive when spear fishing, I swam straight into a great white who promptly left the area. So it was a big wake up call to me. I was still very intimidated by sharks and for, for many years, I didn't actually dive when the guy said there's lots of sharks around. I soon learned that if there were sharks around, there were fish. So when I dived when there were no sharks, there was no fish. So I had to learn how to deal with sharks. I then got involved in an organization that wanted to film sharks. And I thought, well, this is my opportunity to show how brave I am. And I started swimming around the ocean with these guys trying to find sharks for them. And I learned how timid these animals are. After a lot of experience with sharks, I realized they're an animal that's been on the earth millions of years. They've been around for a long time because they are generally timid, not really timid, better word, cautious. They're super cautious. If it's something they don't understand, they'd rather back off, run away, leave it and fight another day. So that is my general opinion of what sharks uh, are. They're not really timid, but they're very, very cautious. They rather stay away from something they don't understand. So, you need to be aware they're there. You need to be aware they're a wild animal and you can never predict them 100%. If you try and swim towards a shark, most of the time he'll back away, but there's that one time he may not. So, whatever you take from this, I'm no shark expert, I've dived with a lot of sharks and 99.99% of the time, they will back off when you approach them, no matter how big they are. But there's that one chance in a million that they will react differently. You cannot predict them 100%. Be super wary of them, especially if they're showing strange actions. I've had some strange encounters with the sharks. I've been in the water when somebody's been attacked and it's, it's quite an eye opener. You soon realize you cannot predict these animals perfectly. They are wild animals, treat them no different to any other wild animal. So what I have found that does help is if that odd shark does come that close to you, especially if you're holding a fish, if you manage to get your spear out, you only need to prod it once and very, very seldom can you get that close that you can actually poke a shark off with your spear tip or even your gun. If, if you have it, loaded, don't shoot the shark, poke at it. If you're lucky enough to get that close, which is a rarity and you rupture the skin, that tends to be more than enough to push that shark away and it'll leave you alone. Obviously there's uh, an extreme scenario where they might be super aggro for no rhyme or reason. As I said, they're wild animals. They can do strange things at times, but don't try and swim away from them. That's the worst that you can do. They will see that as a weakness in my opinion. Again, I'm no shark expert. Face them, deal with them, they tend to back off. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Stand by for the next.